Yo, what it do, everybody, man? Welcome back to the Drink More Water channel. Today, we got some, some good content for you guys. I got a lot of catching up to do with you guys. First of all, my lens on my camera broke, so I was out of commission for a little bit, but I got a new lens. That's a long story. Uh, I've been trying to get uh, the Shadow Ones today, the Jordan Shadow Ones today. I took a big time L on those. Y'all know, y'all used to me taking L's. But I got a surprise for you guys. I hit up my boy Streezy. Remember I told y'all he's the sneaker plug. So I hit him up and he got some real dope lined up for me instead. Matter of fact, I'm not even worried about the shadow ones. I got something better, something I've always wanted. So y'all y'all come ride along with me for the ride. I'm going to go pick them up. I might not vlog that. I might just catch y'all back at the studio. Either way, just know I'm going to go pick up some heat. And I'm going to finally be able to do a review for you guys. It's a pair of sneakers I've been wanting for a minute. Meanwhile, I'm here at the gas station filling up, right? I'm filling up my car, and there's this dude up here in the front. He's, man, he's he's on the guitar. Your boy's getting down, man. We might have to go say what's up to your boy. Hold up. Let's go see what's up with your boy, man. What y'all think about this new lens, too? Y'all let me know what y'all think about this new lens. It's supposed to be sharper. It's supposed to be more clear. You know what I'm saying? So far, I'm pretty pleased with it. Shit, it costs enough. You know what I'm saying? This bitch better look like a movie. But, uh, let me see if I got some dollars, bro. So I can get your boy, so I can show y'all how he rocking out over here. Damn, I ain't got no dollars. I just got a $5 bill. He stopped playing music too. Is he playing still? Oh, he playing, he playing. Let's go check your boy out, man, on the vlog, man. You don't get to see this every day. Walk with me, walk with me. Oh shit. Almost got ran over and shit. Check your boy out, man. Give him a little five dollars. Mm. Bro, I got you on my vlog, man. How you doing, bro? Hey, man, how you doing, bro? I'm doing it, bro. You gotta love. Yeah. 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 Sounds good, bro. Thank you, bro. Appreciate it. I always wanted to play the guitar, but it's hard. What's up, bro? I don't even know how to read music. Hell yeah. You play around here a lot, or what? All over. Okay. I'll put it on my YouTube, bro, for everybody uh, to see. Yeah, 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 bro. All right, bro. Appreciate it. <laughs> Your boy getting down over there on the guitar, man. What's he? What he say? His name was Joe something. I don't know. I had to look back on the video. Shout your boy out, man. I'ma shout your boy's Facebook out. Anyways, this camera be like taking some time to focus. That bitch yeah, is clear though. Anyways, bro, I'm learning late. I gotta stop by the ATM so I can meet your boy for the shoe plug, and I'ma uh, I'ma do a, I'ma do a review for y'all here in just a second, man. So, um, like I said, I apologize for being out for a little bit, but I'm back on it, baby. And uh, I got a surprise for y'all here in a little bit. I think they fire. I've been wanting these shoes for a minute. But anyways, I'm talking too much. I'll see y'all boys in a minute. I'll see y'all back at the studio, bro. All right. Cool, man. Just real quick. I know I said that I'd meet y'all back at the studio, but I just had to give a shout out to my man, Rashawn, man. Came through. 
with the sneakers, man. I know they're just general release, but they're some of my grails, man. You know, some shoes I've been wanting for a while. Came out here, met me out here late night, man. Got me for the good price, so I really appreciate you, bro. No, no problem, man. Got we'll the Kobe mask on, man. Y'all know we show love you know to Kobe tomorrow, on the channel. Man, Hall of Fame induction, man. Get your Kobe's. Yes, Don't sir. be selling that stuff. Wear that stuff. You got to wear the Kobe's, man. You got to show respect to the mama, man. Yeah, absolutely. You already know what time it is. Do you uh, you got an Instagram or something like that? Oh, uh, yeah. It's just uh, at Mr. underscore Rashawn, R-A-S-H-A-A-N underscore Payne, P-A-I-N-E. You'll see nothing but half the stuff I've been wearing the last couple months, so Heck yeah. cool check it out. Heck yeah, man. We'll make sure to put your link in the description below, man, so everybody else can check you out, bro. Uh, absolutely, man. But Appreciate much love you. to you, brother. All right, no problem, man. Be give, safe, your brother, man. give your brother my best, man. Yes, sir, I will, right. man. I take know. it easy. All right, man. Welcome back to the studio. Man, if you made it this far in the video, man, I really appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? You're officially a part of the squad, man. I really appreciate the support, the love and support. I noticed that some people kind of skim through a lot of the video. So, like, I really appreciate it if y'all stick to the end with your boy. Check out what we got going on with y'all. This only going to make the channel grow. But anyways, what y'all here for, I know what y'all here for, man. I know you've seen the title. I know you've seen the thumbnail, man. Without further ado, let's get into the feature presentation for today is going to be the Air Jordan Retro Raging Bull 5s, man. Whew. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. Hey, I can't believe I got these, man. You know what I'm saying? First, before we actually get the hands-on uh, review to these, man, I got to give a shout-out to two people, man. First is my brother, Streezy, bro. Man, he came in clutch on these shoes. I told y'all, he's the sneaker pro. We're going to get him on the channel soon. Don't worry about that. He's going to go over all the sneakers he got for y'all. I mean, stupid. His collection is stupid, man. But he set me up to get these shoes, bro. I was going to pay crazy resale just to get these sneakers. I had in my mind that I really wanted them, so I was going to go after them. I called him to make sure I was making the right decision like I always do. And he was like, bro, don't, 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 get, don't, get, don't get snaked out here, bro. I had you the shoes by the end of the day. And by the end of the day... He had me the shoes, man. You know what I'm saying? So big shout out to my brother Streezy, man. That's my that's my that's my best friend, man. You know what I'm saying? So y'all gonna be seeing more of him on the channel. And then my girl, man, my girl got me these shoes. Man, she saw that I was taking so many L's, bro. And she saw that I was just kind of down, bro. I've been wanting to get a sneaker review for you guys for a long time. And she was like, Man, babe, I know you really wanted those fives, man. What we gotta do to get them? You know what I'm saying? How much you need? Like, what can we do? You know, she helped me with the whole process. It's really her that got me these shoes, man. So I really appreciate you, baby, holding me down. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, man, let's get into a, another thing, a story, man. I used to have these shoes released back in 2009. I wanted them so, so bad, man. And uh, I remember I was that was during the time when I was collecting sneakers a lot, man. I had a lot of shoes, probably like, you know, close to like 80, 90 pair. You know what I'm saying? So I had bought 
the pack because these originally came in a pack of two shoes it was the toro bravo pack it was these and then it was a all 3m pair 3m is like reflective it was like a it, it looked like a flat jordan 5 but when the light hit it it was reflective crazy i bought the pack and it only came with the reflective pair it never came with the red pair bro so since 2010 2009 2011 time frame i've been wanting these sneakers so i finally got them in but anyways first of all we're gonna get into the box this is kind of like how the pack was bro it was like a double deck box and it was like wooden and it like represented like like the bullpen you know for the raging bulls like but um it had like the red eyes my brother brought to my attention that it had like the red eyes like somewhere on the pack representing the bull's eyes they don't have that on these but beautiful box either way man check these out so you get the you get the jump man wooden all around the aesthetics are crazy bro you know what i'm saying the aesthetics are crazy and then the sneakers bro and here they go bro the jordan 5 toro bravo man a raging bull from the toro bravo pack retro from back in 2009 finally released in 2011 bro crazy crazy bro you know what i'm saying like i will say that the two that from what i remember the 2009 pack was a little uh it was like a, like a deeper red like a darker red you know what i'm saying i kind of wish they did that on these you know what i'm saying but i mean these these are great i like how the red pops it's a little bit more vibrant in my opinion and like these are just crazy bro definitely had to add these to the collection bro you know you got that beautiful red suede you know what i'm saying on the upper it's crazy man i know y'all got up close looks on the b-roll footage that i shot but i mean just in hand you can see that it's like a crazy popping red bro jordan fives are some of my favorites even though they're like real bulky i really love the design man i really like how they were uh, modeled after the fighter jet it's crazy bro that booty that red that black jump man logo on the back uh just normal man really kind of true to the ogs man you got the you got the pacifier the jordan lace lock i really don't never know how to like style these like any kind of crazy way so i usually just do the regular tie the bow tie you know what i'm saying on top of the pacifier crazy you got the icy icy bottoms you know what i'm saying with the red jump man i remember the jump man on the originals were black i like how that red kind of stands out and um i like the iciness of the soul as well hopefully you know what i'm saying these don't yellow like crazy like the old ones do i like i know if you see a 2009 pair nine times out of ten they're gonna be yellowed on the bottom and stuff like that well, i mean a lot of them still look good i would still like to have an og pair one day but I got these, so I'm Gucci, man. Also, the the icy uh, the icy netting, you know what I'm saying? I think it's gonna prevent that yellowing that is happening in the two, 2009 pair. Crazy, bro. You know what I'm saying? You got the black jump, man, on the tongue right there. You know, surrounded by that 3M that 3M material on the tongue. So when the when the sun hits it, it's gonna really pop. You know, crazy, bro. I really like everything about this shoe, man. I really like everything about these. Uh, I had to add it to my collection, like I said, bro. Um, just you can kind of style it with everything. With these, they're a little loud. So what I would do with these for a fit is I would just kind of, you know, wear something like a little bit more solid, a little toned down. You know what I'm saying? Just maybe like all one color, maybe like all black or something. And then on the bottom, just pop with the red, you know, mix it up different ways. But I'm just saying I wouldn't do too much on the top you know what i'm saying i would uh i would kind of let the shoes do the do the popping for you you know what i mean that's just me that's personally how i would swag it um man i can't say enough about these man i know this is a shoe that i'm probably gonna take a while to kind of like break out you know i gotta you know they're all suede so i'm gonna definitely make sure i hit them with some protectant um before I, before i rock them but it's gonna be a special occasion when i rock them you know for the first time probably actually you know what i'm capping i was gonna wear them today or tomorrow but it's kind of raining where i'm at and i'm definitely not rocking with the rain bro I de it's definitely got to be nice sunny cool dry you know it's got to be a good situation for me to pop these out man but uh 
But yeah, bro. Crazy. Crazy. I know I missed these when they originally released. So for me to be able to still pick them up later in the year, it's a beautiful thing, man. Beautiful thing. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know what y'all favorite Jordan silhouette is. You know what I'm saying? Um, fives are kind of up there for me. I like 14s a lot. Jordan 14 is probably one of my favorite silhouette. I mean, probably my favorite silhouette, I'd say. I love Jordan 13s. Of course, the threes are hard. Um, you know, those are, those are probably my favorites. I like uh, like certain silhouettes of the sevens are like real near and dear to my heart, like the Bordeaux sevens, uh, the Citrus sevens, stuff like that, man. And I'm gonna try to get more sneakers like from the past that I can bring back. I know this isn't like an exclusive review. I didn't get these shoes right when they came out, but I got these shoes, you know what I'm saying? So that's, I'm not really a hype beast, bro. I get what I like. And I'm going to show y'all what I like. Y'all talk to me in the comments below and let me know if y'all agree with me or y'all think I'm tripping or y'all got a sneaker that y'all really like and y'all want me to review. I'm going to try to get my hands on it, man. So, um, you know, also shout out to Rashawn once again, man, for hooking me up with these sneakers, meeting me late night, bro. Uh, he, he, you know, he came in clutch on that, man. I had to have him the same day. He brought them to me after work. So that's, that's crazy, man. Much love to him, bro. Uh, much love to the uh dude that was uh playing the guitar out front of the uh out front of the store earlier that was crazy man it was it was really hilarious bro i was really laughing at that dude but he was actually he was cool too at the same time bro like you know he's good people's bro I, I respect anybody out there grinding and staying down with their craft that's what this channel is about that's what this movement is about if y'all didn't know you know what i'm saying everybody here is a part of the drink more water crew you know what i'm saying so with that being said, bro, um, drink more water. Always try to be the best version of yourself. You know what I'm saying? And remember, bro, you'll never quit. You never lose until you quit, bro. You know what I'm saying? So I just want y'all to remember that, man. Keep it pushing. If you got something you love, keep doing it, whether it's making videos whether it's making music whether it's collecting sneakers whether it's giving back whatever you do man keep doing it man and you're never gonna lose it till you quit anyways we got a lot more coming up for you guys bro um you know like i said i'm gonna be as consistent as possible i'm headed back to work now but y'all know i'm gonna keep the content coming man so i appreciate y'all for tuning in man and until next time i holla at y'all